for the first time in, uh, what, seven or eight years, we're here at Ten Pin Alley in Las Cruces for the title match of today's JBT event, and a few minutes from now, somebody's going to win their first title of any type, as Jacob Gill and Ryan Ghost are playing for the title here. They each have a second place finish in handicap, and this is each bowler's first title match in scratch. So, uh, great to see some different faces on the show, good for the tour, two guys who've really paid their dues. Uh, finally going to break through with the win here, one of them. Jacob opened in the first while Ryan has gone strike spare for the early lead. And bowled a Super Survivor today, so with Super Survivor the lowest score is out after each game, and then the lowest two totals are out after each game. The guy who's about to start talking bowed out in third, Mr. Yoder, who grabbed the points lead with his third place finish. And these are the two that remain standing. We got a hand handicap finishing there uh, round of six here in just a couple of minutes. So William and Jacob's brother Brandon are going to take you through the next couple of minutes here. Start talking now. Hello, folks. Oh my goodness. <laughs> we got Jacob Gill on the plane three right now. He's throwing the infinite one. Old ball, but still an Ebonite ball. Ebonite ball. Good ball. Ageless Ebonite. There you go, both Ebonite bowlers. Jacob switched to two hands, what, about a year ago? About a year ago. Was it that long? I started being an my senior year. Plays a couple years, Ryan will be the unusual one bowling one handed. Who does that anymore? Pretty good shot, but comes up heavy. He's a 6 7 straight. 10. 4 7 10. Two contrasting styles we got here. Definitely. Got down and in. Down and in by Ryan and Jake who's hooking the whole lane. Yep. Which only two bowlers did today. Well, that's unusual that. carry here. That alley. And terrible carry. You hit them, they fall. It's amazing here. But Ryan with five ball pins. So far you got. Ryan with 44 in the third, strike spare, 7 out. Jake with a 29 in the second frame, a strike in the third. Possible 5 pin lead, maybe you can send it to 15. Good shot, good shot, right? buries it. It's pretty much where we had to play today. Anything outside 10 was kind of dead. Hold on. Interesting too. We bowled on middle road. Just did not play did like not middle, road. middle road at all. Played like Paris, if anything. <laughs> These old wood lanes, anything can happen. CJ standing all the way against the fall return. Him and Cortez Shank are the only two that took the whole lane. Kept it inside. Inside a little bit. And goes up heavy. 4-9. Oh, 
both of them are bowling with Evan and I bowling balls. Ryan using the Cyclone, old down and in type bowling ball. Infinite one. That retro ball on Woodlands is just amazing. Wish I had my vital sign today. Pretty good shot. Pretty good. That light. Oh, there you it that. carries. See Ryan getting pumped from that. Let's see if Jake can find something here in the sixth. Pretty good ball. And flat that ten. Flat ten. What you saw all day. Wrap or flat? Or four pin. Or four pin, yeah. Like uh, got a key. Team Williams be uh, joining us here. The Take hometown the hero. Very nice. A lot of wood popped out. Another one. Wow, he's got two dead bodies. <laughs> Ian, how does it feel to bowl in your home bowling alley for the first time in seven years? Felt good. Felt good. Felt good. Didn't have to care on lane three. Felt good. Kept it inside. Oh. Alright, leaves a six minute. How do you feel the planes play today? They play like Middle Road? No. No? no? Yeah. No. Definitely a mixture between Paris and Middle Road right now. Taking the six pin. Nice. Covers that very nicely. Shake needs right to find up. something soon. In order to give Brian something. Brian has a pretty good load. He's got the in the deadwood. Uh, he's just gonna walk up and walk all over the lane. All over the lane. Uh, trips the sweep on both awesome lanes. Ryan, change your score. Hey. Can you take off that gutter in the seventh frame? Can you tell them to? Yeah, I think I, I got Ryan it. Ryan There's Jeff. There's Jeff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> got Jeff on camera here. A couple of handicap boards. How many minutes yeah. Seven. Seven minutes? Yeah. After the shot. So we'll see what happens in part two because it takes Ryan a while to.